taking a time here to talk things over is a smart idea. One of the things you want to do is make sure everybody is clearly on the same page with the game plan. And sometimes you need a timeout to make sure that's the case. And now Doris Burke has an update from the sidelines. Thank you, guys. I got a chance to hear what Randy Whitman was saying to the team. He tried to really fire them up to bring it home, saying, all night, you have all night to rest after the final buzzer. For now, we have to lay on the line and try to bring it home. Hey guys, back to you. Thanks, Doris. Wall attacks. Again, the miss by Wall. Miami trails by three. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on John Wall. Bortzatz jumped in for Washington. And then for Miami, Matumbo comes in for Hassan Whiteside. Davis is subbed in for Luol Dang. One minute now into this fourth quarter. Curry dishes to Davis. That one, no question, powered it down. Threw it down with authority. Oh, he can really fly. And you combine that, Clark, with some of the nice penetration, too. And you've got an easy two points. And able to just play well above the rim. I mean, that makes this guy so dangerous when he's in the game. And that's the way you want to defend. Nice job. Bro. Always important to have that good interior defense. Oh, and here comes Wall. Oh, and Wall. Comes down the breakaway jam. And that was pretty. That was just a nice looking reverse jam right there. Use the rim, Clark, to protect the ball. Yeah, it did a nice job with it. And guys, how much this awareness there with that finish in traffic. Here's Beal. That's good. And so Wall with the assist. Nine points here for Beal. Is it the Matumbo? It's stolen by Wall. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. The nine foot shot. His touch has disappeared on him this quarter. He just hasn't been able to get it going. Curry kicks to Davis. And finally, he in that time before dropping in and they'll be counting on even more points from him. That's essential if they're going to pull this game out. Beal the pass to Wall. Mene outside. And so it looks like Washington will retain possession here. Thompson, he's checked in for Dwayne Wade. David Thompson. Just over two and a half minutes played now in the final quarter of regulation. He's been wayward and just off on about everything he's put up. And the jam by Smith. And that is a major lead flush right there, my friends. And in a tight contest like this, Greg, that might be just what they need to get the tide rolling in their direction. You're exactly right. I mean, so often when the team gets that kind of explosive play out of its backcourt, that can really rally and galvanize the whole squad. Curry against Wall. He wants to get it to Nene in balance. And it's blocked by Matumbo. Miami trailing. Curry dishes to Johnson. That gives them the lead. And look at how the hustle game has been going for Miami. You know, block shot guys, a clear indicator on the stat sheet of their excellent defense. I mean, leaving them no room to get off any shots. Yeah, and they've also done a great job of playing in space, getting out in transition every opportunity. He worked himself into a really good position there, right near the basket. That's the look he wants. And he gets it to go. Excellent ball movement there, guys. And that's keyed this run, passing it with purpose. The D hasn't been able to keep up. And they get it. That's in the Miami Wolves, but down to a single point after the basket from Beal. I tell you what, you don't want to allow too many of those kinds of baskets with the game on the line. This is when the defenders really have to protect the basket. You need to be in sync as a unit defensively. And Miami making a change here. Von Bruce checked in. 
Here is Miami now. They've given up just eight points in the fourth quarter. Davis kicks to Curry. Back to Davis. LeBron outside. Davis again, and it's Davis laying it in. Davis has got the lead up to three now for Miami. Well, I tell you what, I need to see some more assertiveness out of these defenders. They're not getting the job done. That's a great point. Ten of the last 12 points they've allowed have come at the rim. Washington calls timeout. They're losing by three. 153 left in the fourth quarter. staring us right in the face and we've been around long enough to know when a game is over and this one is in that category well the clock has become their worst enemy not a friend anymore they've got to work quickly from here and that lead pass allowed him to get straight to the rim unabated in stride here's davis by seven really well done there just confident and composed never in a hurry about seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks and ball kicks to beal can't hit great t that time from davis there's the dish to moncrief it's tipped ball with the steal james against pierce beal the pass to gorta from past the arc, can't get it to go. Outstanding perimeter defense there. That was a well-contested shot. Yeah, and you know he takes a lot of pride in his defense. There are no easy threes if he's on. And so it's Miami winning this one. This was a hard-fought, well-earned victory for him, Greg. They really had to work for this win. And that's a good point. I mean, weaker teams might have buckled at the end with the crowd amped up, everyone in the building kind of rooting against you. But they stood tall and, and pulled it out. Well said. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Clark Kellogg, Craig Anthony, and Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan along with our entire 2K sports crew thanking you for tuning in. And as we leave, we give you our Jordan player of the game, 
Steph Curry.